the way the high five game works is that the tall person stands up straight and then puts their hand up as high in the air as they can, and I take a running leap at it to high five them. Um, but the person I was playing with was six foot seven or six foot eight. Wow. Oh gosh. Which it turns out is too tall for the high five. <laughs> <laughs> wow. And I, so we were at the bar. Everybody came out of the bar to watch me play the high five game because I mean, because I talked a lot about it and how great it was going to be. <laughs> and I ran <laughs> and I leaped in the air and I fell and I popped my knee out like right in front of everybody. Just popped oh, right no. in the bucket. And I was like, it's cool. I just rolled over and popped my knee back in and went back into the bar and sang Total Eclipse of the Heart. Wow, nice. <laughs> Karaoke bar. What's the most embarrassing moment you had in high school, Kevin and Elena? Starting with Kevin. Kevin, you go first. <laughs> Oh god. Uh, <laughs> this ought to be good. Well, there's not really that many, I guess, embarrassing where I was trying to do something that didn't work out the way Yeah, nothing. I was always cool. That is a lie. <laughs> okay, I, when I got kicked out of the school play, because I... We had this stupid joke between, like, the girl, you know, there's, like, a girl's dressing room and a boy's dressing room, and there was, like, some joke about how, like, girls were, or boys were better than girls, or girls were better than, I don't know, it was a stupid thing, and one of the girls in the past uh, was writing a note to the boys that said, like, you know, boys are idiots, I don't know, it was something stupid, and I thought it would be funny if she wrapped a panty liner around it threw it into the boys room. That was my, like, you know, like, give it the girl signature. That is awesome. I got kicked out of school. Oh, boy. It was very embarrassing trying to explain that to me. I'm sure Why did you get kicked out of the school play? Because I threw feminine products into the boys' dressing room. Like, how do you explain that? What's your favorite food? I think I said sushi. I'm not sure if that's true. I just left you guys behind, by the way. Yeah, where, where, what's happening? Oh, we're just talking about helping each other. Every man for himself. Yep. All right. That's cool. I don't even need your help. I'm gonna win this by myself. Wait, wait, hold the door. <laughs> <laughs> Who am I, you guys? Am I JFK? I think we need to give away a poster after this game. What do you guys think? I think so. Yeah. Elena's gonna have to come up with a creative way to do that. I'm gonna have to come up with a way to get to give away a poster? Yeah, you can think of something cool. There's a question about the saddest moments of our lives. <laughs> the saddest moments? That's a little... It's getting really personal. I would have to say when I found out that uh, Arrested Development was no longer going to put out a <laughs> <laughs> Mine was... <pro> <coughs> <laughs> Mine was probably when Garfield died. Or Mr. Goodfoods. I had a cat named Mr. Goodfoods. <laughs> when Jem went off the air. Like, who, oh, named, yeah. who names their cat Mr. Goodfoods? I can't even explain it to this day. Like, why did you name your cat Mr. Goodfoods? I don't know. I really don't. Somebody's inviting me to play Call of Duty with them. Like, am I obviously not playing Call of Duty right now with a bunch of people? I love it! Nobody's died yet? Is that like possible? Nobody yet. Shock. What's the favorite song she's created for the zombie game? I don't know how that... That's a more trick. Right. Well, this, yeah. she sang them, but Kevin created them, so... Yeah, so... Re restructure that Do you have a favorite, question. Kevin? No. That's a, that, it's kind of funny, like, how that works, though. Like, everybody says... 
And I'm sure it doesn't bother know. Kevin or anybody, but... Um... Everybody, th like... It's like Elena's songs, you know what I mean? <laughs> it's kind of a weird I thing. Like, I mean, like, I always used to think that people who sang the songs that I liked were the people that made them. Yeah, that's true. Yeah. I, I do want to... I do have a question, though. Did you ever influence any lyrics or anything about the song? Or change anything? Uh, if yeah, I did, it was uh, really minor. No, I see, uh -oh. like, you know, like, uh, I've, I've taken lines from her, uh, her album. Really? Oh, that's right, I mean, in, uh, The One. Really? From her actual album she's working on now? Yeah, there was, uh, the, the, the line, uh, Thick Viscous Glue in The One. Nice. Is, uh, is this line from one of my songs, Let It Go Again. Because, as everybody knows, alternative country <laughs> singer-songwriter and zombie metal are two great tastes that go together. <laughs> nice. I left everybody behind again. The the whole thing started basically where I just I just written a riff, you know, the death song to knock different Toten. Which is such a good riff. It is excellent. It was supposed to be with just that little thing, you know, and, and like, then you're like, like this, this would be cool. Thing. And then Brian, the boss, you know, my boss, like you should turn that into a song. And I argued with him like, there's no fucking way this can. There's no song here. There's no there's yeah. no potential here. Like, I'm the artist, you don't know what you're talking about. <laughs> and then we just did, and uh, he's like, hey, Elena sings. I'm like, okay, so right for a female vocal part, it just kind of happened, and didn't think anything of it, really. And then it was magic. You oh, stink on that. it was magic. Well, it's funny, because I, I rem like, yeah, Kevin was like, you want to sing this? And I was like, sure, it's not my style, but, you know, I'll, right. I'll give it a shot. And then I was like, uh, you know, at first, I was like, kind of like, just trying to be as like over the top with it as possible. But then <laughs> I was like, I really like this. <laughs> nice. See, this is some stuff I didn't even know. I'm get, I'm excited about this. Well, and Lullaby was, uh, I mean, it's different, I think, from the other ones. Yeah, yeah, definitely. Like, it was before we had really, like, any concept of how we were going to work together, and... Oh, no! <laughs> Yay, Elena died. <laughs> <laughs> and it was, like, really low for me. Yeah, it was pretty low. <laughs> yeah, the first song that you sang. Yeah. yeah. I keep under my bed. But I still did, I did my best. It still came out good. It did, so they're not really good. <laughs> Your stance reminds me of the 20th century. Elena and Kevin, me, like, if, you, if you could be one of the four characters from Zombies, who would it be? <laughs> and why? <laughs> right, right, right yeah, now, why? Nikolai. For yeah, I'd have to be, I'd go for Nikolai too. Mostly just so that I could talk out loud about all the um, wives of mine that I killed. But <laughs> then again, I want, I want to say uh, Dempsey. So I could have freedom. <laughs> Dempsey's, Dempsey's freedom? So I could have freedom? <laughs> Why didn't you write a song for five? That's Rapid a good question. Fire, doesn't fit it, it doesn't fit into the backstory, <laughs> that's for one. Well, let's, let's face it, uh, who has, who knows who Eminem is and who knows who I am? <laughs> yeah, right? Point of that. <laughs> and then uh, the second is we... Five kind of came along in the process extremely late. Really late. Uh, development cycle. Yeah. And I wouldn't even have had time to do it if I could. If you wanted to? Well, I, I didn't even have time to think about it. Yeah, you couldn't, you couldn't even have done it if you wanted to, is what I basically Right. You know what, though? I'm pushed. You know what, though? I'm glad they didn't do a song, your song in in this map because it doesn't fit in with the backstory and stuff. Seriously?
It's so hard to see Kevin all dead and not revive him. I know, no He's revival. Dead. No revival. Keep your I know. fingers off my uniform. It's fun this way though. Are you having fun playing Sabotage Zombies? Yeah, I am. I am mean, actually really enjoying myself. <laughs> the pressure to contribute is kind of off. Yes, there is no. All these tacos are good. Oh, make oh me my jealous. God! You are you are tormenting me. I could go <laughs> for some tacos right now. There is not a single delicious taco in the entire state of Massachusetts. Oh, that's right. Yeah, I remember. <laughs> but you know what I'm gonna do after this, Kevin? I'm gonna go to Mike's Pastries and I'm gonna eat as many cannolis as I want. <laughs> How do you like me now? Where's the final radio? <laughs> or I mean the oh, final phone. Not smoke in this cigar to cover that thing. Ah. We are now at death mall. Security lockdown active. Oh, I'm back. Holy crap. <laughs> I didn't realize <laughs> Welcome that. I'm back. I almost died again. Can somebody get him back damn up there? Oh no, oh no. This is going to be a very short <laughs> round for me to get in. Oh no, I'm dead. Is there a radio with a power switch? Someone nice! That. Somebody's Justin TV name is Elena Fan. Nice. Nice. <laughs> I think that's his YouTube name too, right? Ask him. <laughs> it could be. I've seen it before. Uh... There's really a what, lot are you of stalking Elena again, Kevin? Oh. Jeez. Oh my god! No! No! Be sure to become a fan of Kevin and Elena on Facebook by visiting those links. Okay. Alright, for both of you, uh, what kind of zombie type would you be? Like, a, as in crawler, normal zombie, crawler. hellhound, or monkey? Bon Friar, thank you. Who won? How did that happen? Did you guys see that? Uh, did Elena win that? Not do very well. Who was the last person alive? Kevin and Elena, do you I guys have a thing? <laughs> no, that's a no. <laughs> <laughs> do I have a what? Like you're like you're you have a thing for each other. That was Kevin. Uh, no, Kevin yeah, is married. Like, they want to know if we were Sunny and Cher, basically. Yes. Bon R, yeah, thank you for there. joining our game, dude. I'm sorry you didn't have a mic, but it was fun. And thank you for joining. Yeah, I'm sad that you didn't have a mic, Bon Friar. Bon Friar. Bon Friar. <laughs> bon Friar. Oh, that's, that sounds way cooler when you say Bon Friar, like Bonfire. Oh, like Bonfire. Yeah. That's awesome. Uh... All right, my good friend. Todd Barbie said, Kevin's married, I'm out. <laughs> <laughs> All right, so we're gonna do a poster giveaway. Elena, do you have a cool way to do it? Have you thought of anything? Oh cool? God, ah, uh, what's a cool way to give this? Oh, wait, let me go to the chat room really quickly. Look at things. Uh, man, I'm on the spot. Like I didn't even think that. I could think of something if you can't. I'm trying to think. But I'm popping up chat and I'm closing this so I don't get knocked offline. And all right, okay. Uh, you can probably find this by googling. But there was I was in a band with another member or another person that worked at Treyarch for a little while. And if you guys know what band that was, get a poster. Don't even JD you know 2020. The <laughs> <laughs> That's true. I, I do know the answer. Okay, somebody, no, I'm not talking about. I'm not talking about the giant, and I'm not talking about my album. I'm talking about somebody that I was in a band with at Treyarch. He worked at Treyarch, and he had JD his own band. JD 2020 is not the correct answer. There's a name of the band that you need to come That's up with. That's it. You got it. Woo! The hero got it. Did he really? Yeah, we got Elvis Simmons and the Memphis Strutters. Who? What? Who? Okay. Oh, yeah. Who had it? Oh, the Duck Canadian Hero. Okay, Canadian, listen to me. I need you. I'm going <laughs> to message you on JTV. Hold on. You need to reply to my message with your address so that 